Hello and welcome to my channel. It's Sherry Taylor, independent graduate gemologist and registered master valuer, owner and founder of S. Taylor Jewelry Appraisal. Today I'm going to be doing a demonstration with the gemological tool, the polariscope, which works by transmitting a plane of polarized light into a gem. Let's get started. Here we go. A polariscope is primarily used to determine whether a gemstone is singly or doubly refractive. This aids in the identification process when combined with other gemological testing. The polariscope can be used with any gemstone that is transparent or translucent, and here I have some watermelon tourmalines that I'm going to be using to demonstrate. So with the light on, we're going to look through the analyzer, the polarizing filter at the top of the polariscope. And if we see light coming through, we're actually going to turn that analyzer until the light is reduced. All right, so now the light has been reduced to its lowest level. So now what we're going to do is we're going to place the gemstones table down for the faceted stone and flat side down for the cabochon onto the polarizer at the bottom here. All right, so now we're gonna look through the analyzer and we're gonna rotate that bottom piece there 360 degrees. Now, if the stones stay dark through the entire rotation, then that means that they are singly refractive or isotropic. And if they blink um, from light to dark sort of multiple times throughout the rotation, it means the gemstone is doubly refractive. If they stay light through the entire rotation, then it means that your stone is an aggregate. So basically a transparent crystal made up of multiple or many smaller crystals. I'm going to use the faceted tourmaline because it gave a really nice crisp blinking. As you can see, as we rotate it, it's blinking nicely, telling us that this gemstone is doubly refractive. In a future video, we will cover the confirmation test and optic character. All right, that concludes our video. I hope you enjoyed the demonstration on the polariscope. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, please consider liking and subscribing. Click the notification bell. Thank you so much for watching.